morning friends welcome back to another vlog the first thing you need to do is make my breakfast because i literally cannot function when i don't have breakfast i'm the kind of person that wakes up in the morning and immediately my first thought is food make my food <laughs> workout. I'm currently doing Lily Sabri's Hourglass Sculpts and Toe workout. I'm on week three and if you didn't know this about me I do actually have another YouTube channel which I post all my fitness reviews and contents of home workouts and things I recommend and me trying fitness challenges. I will be doing a review on that channel so if you want to check that out I'll leave a link to my other channel below but so far I'm really enjoying the Lean with Lily app. If you haven't used the app before I would recommend downloading it just to give it a go. Anyway let's get started today's one is i think let me check full body strength and we've just started getting into slightly longer workouts this lululemon workout set is giving me life right now it's just so soft oh yeah this one wait for the drop as much as i love my bangs they're not the greatest for working out in. So I'm gonna to need to tie these up. And that is not a look. It's actually a bit later, I've been editing a video and now I need to go and do some errands because the things I've just been putting off for like 10 million years. Does anybody else do this where you just don't want to do something so you just put it off for like weeks and weeks and weeks and if you just did it on the first day it would be done and then you would need to think about it. Yeah, I don't do that either. <sighs> Are you coming with me so I have company? No. <sighs> Okay, I'm gonna go and do my chores then, alone. <laughs> Poor mannequins had a bad time. <laughs> Can I get a, a regular chai latte with coconut milk? Thank you. Okay, I'm back home now. I did my errands. I'm really proud of myself. I'm just going to do some editing while well, I'm actually doing a thumbnail. Put you down. I've edited the video, I just need to do the thumbnail. Sorry, let me test it. My new obsession, right? Let me test it. The milk is a bit cold, but it's tasty. My new obsession is chai latte with coconut milk. Now, I used to get almond milk, but I had a coconut milk one day because a cafe I went to didn't have almond milk, and it was literally so much nicer. So now, ever since that day, like two weeks ago, <laughs> I've been having chai latte with coconut milk. Mm, delicious. This is my cheat for doing all my errands. It wasn't even that many errands. I also picked up a parcel from Concierge which isn't really that exciting, but it's kind of adulty exciting. So I'll show you that afterwards when I finish my chai latte. I'm gonna do some editing now. Okay, this I think is my finished product. What do we think? I find thumb doing thumbnails really freaking hard. Like, I don't know if I'm just not that aesthetic, but anyway, this is what I'm going with, so. Okay. Good morning, it's a new day. I'm just getting ready because I'm going to a Hendy. It is currently like 10.30, but it takes quite a while to get there. So I'm getting ready way in advance so that I'm not rushed. And I'm gonna straighten my hair and then curl it. So it's kind of like bouncy, blow dry curls. Cause I mean, I like my curls, but they're a bit wild sometimes. And sometimes I just want them to be a bit more tame putting some heat spray protectant on. I don't know, I just use this Cantu one. I don't know how it compares to other ones. Right, it says it 
reduces frizz and flyaways and shields hair from heat up to 425 degrees Fahrenheit. Whoa, wait, what? I think that's a completely different like, metric system. It's not metric, like measuring system for heat than I'm used to because 425 degrees Fahrenheit sounds a lot. I'm gonna come back to you when my hair is straightened because it's literally just gonna be me going for 10 million hours because I have so much hair and it's so curly. Three, two, one. Okay, it's like literally not done properly because I just wanted to do a rough, a rough straightening. But I'm ready. I'm ready as if this is what I'm gonna go like to the hen do. No. But I don't know whether to do my makeup next or to do my hair curls next. I feel like I should do my hair curls next and then do my makeup, but I'm not sure. Because what I can do is I can pin up and leave them to set whilst I'm doing my makeup. I'm just not sure. It's not sure at all. I want to have lunch before I go because as I said it starts at 2pm. I need to leave here at 12.30ish so I need to have food before because there's going to be no lunch when we get there. It's going to be more like nibbles until we have the evening thing. We're going to the bride-to-be's house for like party games, drinks, nibbles, all of that stuff and then in the evening we're going to go for dinner in Chelsea. Fancy. Look at all this hair that's come out. I saw this TikTok once of this lady who collects all of her single strands of hair and then makes it into a little extension i mean i feel like that's just a little bit creepy i mean it's a good idea but especially for me because there's not really any hair extensions that match my hair but i'm just not going to be going around collecting all these pieces of hair and making them into extensions okay look at how much i did not straighten this you got is this even on I think my brain is just subconsciously really risk averse so I always just turn it off as soon as I finish using it or for like one second I just automatically go turn it off. I honestly think this is literally how they used to wear the hair in like the 80s. It was that movie 13 going on 30 where the girls they always wear it on top of their head like this and they're walking around. If you haven't seen my birthday vlog, go and check it out. I loved that hair, honestly. The hairdresser did such a good job of like cutting it, styling it. She just made it look so easy and then I'm like, oh my God, I can do that. And actually, I'm not going to be doing it very well because this doesn't seem to want to go how I want it to. Now for the hard bit. The fringe. Oh my God. Oh. Oh, was it actually as simple as that? Oh, wow. Okay, I'm going to brush it out, but I'm not going to brush it out yet because I want it to cool. And I, if I brush it out now, I just feel like it's just not going to stay very well and I'll have no curls by the time I get to where I'm going. This is my favourite song at the moment. My favourite song. Have I literally had toothpaste hit the whole entire time? R.I.P. Mildly embarrassing. This is my other new favourite song because he just sounds so happy. In my birthday vlog, you'd have seen that I got my eyebrows laminated. Now, I'm not gonna lie, they didn't really last very long. Uh, literally, after a couple of days, they weren't really that laminated anymore. And I did everything right. I didn't get them wet. I didn't do it like for 24 hours. I did everything I'm supposed to, and they just didn't last for me. So, I mean, they're still not completely gone, but they just didn't, they don't as laminated like perfect for more than a few days but yeah i do have to use this and i just use this refi refi brow thing i think this is the finished look i am not the best at makeup but this is where it's at i feel like it doesn't look bad so i'm making some tuna pasta i feel that tuna pasta will keep me filled up for longer because i've got quite a lot of day and dinner's not until 8 p.m which is very late for me to eat i like eating at like 6 37. so 8 p.m i'm gonna be bouncing off the walls and it's not even that because it's three courses so we're only gonna get our starters oh my god i'm gonna die of starvation but if i have tuna pasta now then that should last me over and then i've also packed snacks probably the weirdest person let me show you my bag this bag okay it's not all filled with snacks it's got other things in there as well that would be really weird i've got a change of bag so that i can dress up my outfit in the evening i have a change of shoes this is just a bag but it's got strappy shoes in them and then i've got a makeup bag with all my makeup in 
And then I've got <laughs> just in case I get hungry. Oh, and also a Lucas aid for when I'm traveling back because I feel like this is the best avoiding hangover or feeling rubbish the next day because it hydrates you. So I'll have that on the journey back. Oh yeah, and also got some NEMS. And that is my bag. So I'm gonna take this with me. Where we've got dinner, we've got a private room, which is fancy. So I'm just gonna be able to leave it on the side so no one will steal it. The annoying thing about this bag though is it's like open, so you can get in, but there's nothing that really in here. Okay, let's make lunch. L lunch? <laughs> let's make lunch. Let's make lunch because I feel like I'm gonna run out of time otherwise jabbering away. Okay, here's my outfit. It's like a long brown dress. <laughs> I don't even know how to describe it, it's from ASOS. But it's got this cute back, wait, this cute back detailing. I'm just gonna take some photos now before I look rubbish by the time I get there and then at least I can say that I look nice at one point in the day. I literally was trying to find where I was supposed to be going on Google Maps and my internet wasn't working. It's supposed to show you how much we rely on the internet to do anything. What do people do in the olden days? <laughs> I have no idea. Don't let them transform your 